Hello, Aunt Frankie. Wish you were here. We have a beautiful turnout, and we've interviewed all of the students this year, of which there are five recipients. Each one will be receiving Sweet Arts catalog, and uh, we have some excellent, beautiful paintings and sketches and photographs that they've each done. We have plenty of catalogs left. Hope all's well. Take care, lots of love. Hello Frankie, here we are, ready to start the program as we do every year, but something very important is missing, and that's you. We're already missing you. Uh, you're missing five very, very talented students. I know you have loved to see them, but we understand. So we're sending this video so you know that uh, we're still here, celebrating your legacy, celebrating everything that is so good about the arts. And I hope that next year we'll have you again with us. So in the meantime, thank you and goodbye. Hi Frankie, um, this is the luncheon that's happening now and we're gonna create a, a video memory of some of the students talking about their art because I know how much you like that and I really wish you could be with us today. We miss you. Ms. Wolfson, my name is Nguyen Vu, and I'd like to sincerely thank you for giving me this recognition, and I'd like to introduce you to my oil painting. Um, working on this piece, I learned a lot about self-discipline, mostly, because it's such an intricate process, and I learned that um, I had to really get into a flow state to really finish the painting. I can't imagine myself doing anything else, and to me, artists wear communicators of the people. I'm using it as a catalyst to really spark change. My name is Edgar Orlando Campo. Um, I want to thank you for this opportunity, Ms. Wilson. I wanted to do something that froze time pretty much. No one captures the moment of the city and the traffic all at once. And that's what really inspired me to really do this photo. The reason why I love photography is because there's so many perspectives to see it from. Hi Ms. Wilson, um, my name is Gabrielle Venture and I'm really excited and humbled to uh, win the Wilson Scholarship Award. It means a lot to me and I really thank you for the opportunity to um, continue my passion. This is, I call it Angel. I was uh, working in printmaking and uh, we were learning how to do collagraphs and monotypes. And the collagraph is the wing here. I did it in a board um, and I printed it like an intaglio plate. And then the blue in the background is monotype washed, which I just printed on the paper. And then I drew on top of it um, this image of Andrew Thay. He's a model um, who I love his work. In interest of bringing more representation to my art, I was hoping to do more people of color. Hi, Ms. Wolfson. My name is Ingrid. Uh, this is my artwork. I, I labeled it or titled it Patience. I have dolphins kind of represent the tranquility of the animals and how beautiful they are. I really enjoy the ocean a lot and I have patience here which is on the Japanese stone because I very much like the Japanese culture as well. I think it's beautiful. Uh, and I have portraits of myself right here and then my reflection in a little makeup mirror. I have a teacup because I enjoy tea and a lemon here because I can be a little sour sometimes. Hello, Ms. Wolfson. Uh, I'm Amanda Simeon, and I'm one of the recipients of the Francis Wolfson Scholarship. And I want to express my endless gratitude for this award. It'll help me get really far in my studies here at Miami-Dade and further my career as an artist. Um, I want to show you my art that I brought over. It's an ink wash piece about um, portraying the pine rockland of Florida um, in its native species. Highlighting this in art is one of the easiest formats I can think of. Since we partake so much in nature, I think it's only fair that we give back and we continue to preserve it and keep it safe and try not to deplete it because that's where we get our resources from.